ஹலோ ஆல் மை செல்ஃப் மித்ரா ஃப்ரம் டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் ஆஃப் காமர்ஸ் டிஜிட்டல் மார்க்கெட்டிங் அண்ட் டேட்டா மைனிங் டுடே வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு சி அபவுட் கூகுள் அலாட் கூகுள் அலாட் தி வேர்ட் கூகுள் அலாட் இஸ் நத்திங் பர்ட் யூ கேன் கெட் இமெயில்ஸ் வென் நியூ ரிசல்ட்ஸ் ஃபார் அ டாபிக் ஷோ அப் இன் கூகுள் சர்ச் ஃபார் எக்ஸாம்பிள் யூ கேன் கெட் இன்ஃபோ அபவுட் நியூஸ் ப்ராடக்ட்ஸ் ஆர் மென்ஷன் ஆஃப் யோர் நேம் create an alert go to google alert these are the steps for google alert go to google alert in this box at the top enter a topic you want to follow to change your setting click show option you can change how often you get notification the type of sites you will see your languages the part of a world you you want info from uh, how many results you want to see what account get the alert click create alert you will get emails uh, whenever we find matching search results so oh, these are the steps uh, for google alert uh, what are the uh, what are google alert uh, google alert is a, f- a free service created by google which means it's a free kind of service that is created by google that let user to monitor any keyword or phrases they want uh, when you set google alert the system will send email report to your google uh, to your gmail account with a link to where your alert uh, terms have popped up as far as frequency goes uh, google gives you a few option includes as it happening at uh, most once a day at most once a week speak with your marketing team consider your goals and analyze how quickly the information you can track sites uh, when deciding on frequency on uh, on course google alert is not be all end all solution it can't as of now monitor social media mentions which is a huge part of going public conversations around your industry or brand that is why certain google alerts alternate service like keyhole exist to help you keep finger on plus of google media conversations uh, next uh, signing up google alert uh, now that the understand google alerts so let's go over how to set up alert step 1 go to google alert page step 2 enter your search term uh, step 3 click on show option to set your preference step 4 create your alert optimizing google alert for better results to optimize your google alert for success there are a few best practices you should implement these include be specific with keywords you don't want to create a both search term that will uh, that will your inbox with useless information that is why it is better for options real estate tulsa oklahoma and not just real estate don't limit your alert uh, create many specific alert uh, create many specific alert uh, with pictures and uh, uh, with uh, with pictures create many google alert with uh, more pictures and uh, etc be specific uh, be specific uh, with keywords don't limit your alert Uh, create many specific alert with pictures what is happening in your industry try uh, using different modifiers to augment your results for example try out something like uh, tulsa oka real estate trends uh, ex- for example uh, use google's filters use google filters and uh, uh, quotations Uh, in the sense use google filters the filter under the option menu or there for a reason so use them set the region to your service area if you want to filter out low quality results set your alert to show only the best use quotation marks to combine terms when setting the search terms for your alert any anything you place in quotes will generate and extra much so typing tul tulsa okay real estate market will get results for that exact terms on uh, return 
uh, the, but if you add a word outside of the score you can mix the match results uh, use google filters use quotations don't limit your a lot be specific with keywords uh, these are the optimizing better results for google a lot thank you